Hello everybody, this is a short video on uh, how it works with the new FLIR C3 which is the successor of the FLIR C2 with the addition of the connectivity uh, via Wi-Fi. The Wi-Fi can be both peer-to-peer -peer or connected to the uh, Wi-Fi and hotspot and then connect uh, in another way. In the last part we will show you how to connect the phone to the Wi-Fi of the C3. So the Z3 is, a, as we said, is a touch screen and we can start from the right side where we have the setting. In the setting we can go to setup parameter, we can set up emissivity, reflected temperature and distance. Save option, we can see if you, you can save the thermal image from the uh, photo image or have a single file. Device setting, we have language, time units, the Wi-Fi, reset option, auto orientation, power off, display intensity, camera information, and the legal uh, information. We go back to the Wi-Fi later. Then we have the possibility to uh, start the light or flash. So the light will be always on and the flash will be when you click and save the picture. You have different uh, palette of color, iron, rainbow, rainbow high contrast, and gray scale. Oh, by the way, this is our aircon sp uh, splitter here. So we can go back to iron, and then we can take measurement. Maybe this is better for us. So this is the trigger with the, hot, uh, with the cold spot, which goes straight to the splitter, 18 degree. Same for the hot spot, we can remove measurement, or we can add the center spot. center spot. As always, in this moment, we are using the automatic scale, but uh, tapping on the scale, you can uh, block the temperature and regulate in order to avoid the external component to influence in your measurement. By clicking back, you go back to automatic. Here you can set up uh, uh, the MSX where you can adjust the distance. You can have thermal only, so just check the difference between thermal only and MSX. Wow! Then you have picture in picture and digital camera only. At the end, we have images. There is no image saved, but here you will find all the image. So give me one second and we show you how to connect the camera to the phone. Thank you. Okay, now we have a second phone to show you how to connect the cellular phone through Wi-Fi to the C3. So as we saw before, we go to the setting, we go to device setting, Wi-Fi and share. Okay, at this point, the camera has activated the peer-to-peer -peer, uh, communication. As you can see, visible as IRCAM 2027. So now moving to the phone, we go out. And what we want to do is uh, we want to check for the IRCAM. Okay, so now we are connected to the IRCAM. We go out. We connect Clear Tools. And here we, you can download the image from the camera or take a picture. If, let's say, you take a picture, so Okay, so let's say we go back to what uh, we were seeing before. Okay, so we have this. As soon as we click instantanea or a picture, the unit take a picture of the, of the selected. So then we can go back, we can go back, library, picture, and here, as you can see, you can uh, see the picture again. 
So you can move from uh, the thermal image to the digital image and you can uh, uh, forward this image to your friends and colleagues. So for now is everything. Thank you very much. Like the video and see you next time. Bye.